Welcome back to Monday Unedited. If you are new here, it is an unedited video of uh, whatever the heck I'm doing for the day. Today is Sunday, of course. You'll be seeing this Monday, depending where you are in the world. Last week, you might have remembered I uh, was out this way, and this is an area called Mernda. It used to be once pure country land. For anyone who grew up around this area would know, we remember this area just basically being like it is right now, where I am in the middle of a giant untouched paddock. I love this place just like through here. There's so many little ponds with frogs and stuff. But uh, my sister and her parents have just moved up this way, so it's starting to rain. We've, uh, we've had some crazy rain here in Melbourne the last two days massive amounts of flooding it's been absolutely mental and we just got a break in the rain so we thought we'd go for a bit of a hike but i think we're gonna have to hide somewhere because i think the rains are coming again i mean really bad flooding uh, my sister actually had to get saved by the ses in a boat <laughs> in the main town where i live so i'm filming this on the gopro hero 7 you might remember i uh i did a gopro hero 7 test when i first got it but yeah i feel like i've adjusted the settings appropriate now to uh to where it should be. Hopefully the wind isn't jacking the audio too much. I won't really know until I uh, until I watch this back. But just here, there is an old abandoned flume right there. We'll get a little bit closer. So this flume used to carry water, I believe, but it's now no longer in use. But so uh, we can actually walk right up on top of it. Here's the girls. Hola amigos. You know Brittany, you know H. How's yep. it going? She got her backpack full of snacks. <laughs> oh, the wind is shocking at the minute. As soon as I started recording, the wind picked up. It's uh, yeah, going into the long grass. The weather has uh, has really stopped me from filming this weekend, which sucks. As I said, we've had some really bad flooding. Oh, this is cool. Had some really bad flooding through here. So uh, yeah, the river's running pretty crazy down here. It's quite. It's quite uh, quite nice though, there's not a lot of flooding going on. But there you go, there's the flume that once would have carried water straight through here and supplied everyone here with water. Just over the top of the Yarra River. Woo! It's windy, I wonder if I can get down a little bit further. Oh my, maybe I could hide from the wind. <laughs> so, oh, let's get down. I believe that this was built in the early 18 or like the late or let me actually find that out for you i can put it on the screen but i think it was like 1880 something that this was actually built where you can probably see the brickwork behind me it's uh it's very old but no longer in use squad obviously because now around here it's just houses for days no more country life <laughs> it's all about that housing estate now i'm sure at some point hey yeah i'm trying to get away from the wind I'm sure at some point the uh, all of this will be housing, but these little hiking tracks are all around here. It's it's really nice. When I always think of these areas now, I just think of stupid housing estate and taking over country land. But yeah, there's actually some really nice little rivers and creeks around here. I, I really want to bring the drone today and film this, but the weather has been absolutely mental, shocking to be honest. Like I couldn't believe the amount of water that I filmed a little bit of. I think I might have put it on my Instagram story, but. The flooding through the town was absolutely mental. But uh, now the wind stopped, <laughs> of course. Maybe I can head down. God, this really hurts to sit on. As you can see, the water would have flown through here, but now I believe there's a pipe underground rather than up above. Imagine if I fell right now. Usually I wear hiking boots when I do this sort of stuff. But uh, not today, so I'm just keeping my eyes peeled for snakes and stuff. I'm gonna stand up in here because I just heard something rustle through the bushes. <laughs> All right, well, here we go. Here's a better view of the flume. Pretty cool, isn't it? Right? So you can see the river just down there. You might be able to see it. That, that, that's the crap thing about filming on the GoPro is uh, I obviously can't zoom in on things and depth of field and stuff like that. But man, I've, hopefully the audio is nice and everything's good because now I can start filming more with the Hero 7. But what I'm gonna do is attach a microphone to this at some point but right now that's not going to happen with sorry wind with christmas and stuff <laughs> spending that money on others so yeah but don't forget tomorrow or today when you see this um, i'll be doing a live stream monday 9 p.m 
that's Melbourne time, 9 p.m. So if you have any comments you want to leave below, any questions, I will answer them in the live stream. And uh, yeah, we'll try and get that going for about an hour or so. But uh, all right, say goodbye to the Mernda Flume. That's pretty cool. I love all this old stuff that's just down here in the country. It's uh, <laughs> some of the first stuff I just filmed ever on YouTube was all the stuff just out in the country like this, and I love it. I'm a bit big, big nerd for all this sort of uh, stuff left behind. All right, let's uh, let's wrap this one up. You guys ready to keep walking? All right. The Simpsons cloud. <laughs> well, there's the Mernda the Mernda Rail. Oh, what good timing! There's a new train station right there. <laughs> Floyd Bromley, if you're watching this, the uh, the Mernda Trail. Where are we going this way? Around the train, so. All right, let's oh, wrap this one up. Grass. Yeah, I know. <laughs> we'll yeah, we'll have to go back around. All right, we'll wrap this one up. Now, so live stream tomorrow night, 9 p.m. Don't forget that. Let's go this way. Bye. 9, 9 p.m., goodbye. <laughs>